Hello guys, I'm Raven Fox Gamer, and today I'll be showing you how to change your viewport shading, kind of like 3ds Max, and a little bit of ZBrush. So let's begin by clicking here. Make sure that you are in this viewport shader, then clicking the down arrow. My lighting is in studio. My material is in random. I will add a little bit of shadow. And the cavity is ticked on. Change the type to world. And I'll make the ridge to, to 2.5 and the valley to 2.5 as well. So you will have that look. It's much more easier to see if you have like flat edges. Compare it to like a flat shader like this. This is a material with a flat uh, lighting. If you are in this viewport, it's much more easier to see. It has that ambient occlusion kind of look. Of course, it's cavity. Now let's go to making it look like ZBrush. So it's very easy. Let's go back to this mat cap. Change change the mat cap. Let's change the material by clicking here. And there is your ZBrush lighting. The same settings. It has shadows. It has a cavity. And that's pretty much it. You can adjust your settings to whatever you like. You can assign a color of your choice. Let's make it lime green. Or you can even choose the lighting to flat. It's up to you and which is appealing for you and easier for you to work with. So that's all I got for now and this is Urban Fox Gamer signing out.